when you get grateful for what you have right now, you will soon have more to be grateful for. And it's so true. When you send out those feelings of gratitude, what happens? You become instantaneously happy at this moment. When you're grateful and happy with life as it stands today, so many more things will flow into your life to be happy and grateful for. And the reverse is also true. If you feel like there's nothing to be grateful for, what are you focused on? You're focused on everything you don't want. You're focused on everything you don't have. And what you then think you will attract into your experience. Exactly. More of what you don't want. Make your mission to sit down every day and become grateful. Get grateful for the two gifts you have called eyes. Many aren't so lucky. Get grateful for the ears that can hear this music. Get grateful for the person in your life that's made a difference. Get grateful for your tough times because they help develop your strength and spirit. Get grateful for your life. There is so much to be grateful for. There's something to be said about being appreciative and grateful. You know, whether you're thanking God or life or whether you're looking to a person in your world, just say thank you. There's something really special about that. I mean, there's something very real about moments where you can just be by yourself and look at your life and just say thank you. You know, thank you for this gift. Thank you for this ride that I'm on. Thank you for this journey. And a lot of people go through their life without experiencing the beauty of these moments. Your life, although perhaps filled with many imperfections, is still an experience. It's an experience that people in their final moments would do anything just to grasp onto for a little while longer. Can you imagine, as you hear this, there are people who are having their final breaths, taking their final breaths on this planet. Looking back at their lives and wishing they could have done more. Meanwhile, we have this experience. We're alive, we're breathing air, our hearts are pumping, our brain is doing billions of operations per second just to keep the game going for us. We can't find reasons to be grateful for that. We can't as human beings be appreciative for that. There is an entire spectrum of life you are missing out on when you don't take moments to just feel, just feel. Just create moments of gratitude within yourself, just for the sake of being appreciative, for the sake of being alive. That alone will change your life. That will make you human again. That will disconnect you a little from this game of consumerism and this doggy dog world we've allegedly created. That will disconnect you from the insanity of the society and it will reconnect you with something greater than yourself. And I don't care what you call it, call it God, call it the universe, call it life or magic. When you begin to be appreciative for life, there is a certain power that will bring you even more reasons to be appreciative. It's one of life's greatest paradoxes. When you're in a state of needing this and needing that, it doesn't matter how much you acquire, you'll never have enough. When you can have the courage to be grateful for what you already have, life will bless you with even more. You know, you can decide in this moment to give it up. Give up the complaining, give up the blaming and the accusing, give up the gossiping and the whining, and instead realize you're on an incredible journey and fall in love with every second of it. That's when you'll truly come to life.